in the morning when I start the generator and the indicator light is on all I do is push that button till the light goes out <clears throat> gotta tell you what just happened inside the water reservoir light came on and I thought that was kind of freaky because it was about three quarters full now it's totally empty what happened was our solenoid got stuck open and the water was being sucked right through and the water trap caught most of it thankfully some of it did get through the engine I immediately shut off that valve uh, so let that be a lesson to you I'm so thankful that that happened here rather than on the road so we got another issue to work with Here we have the hydrogen generator. Now let's take it apart and see what makes her tick. Fill and view port, the water inlet from the water reservoir, the hydrogen and oxygen gas exit and the wires here are for the level sensor that's underneath the top and there is a groove cut in this material with an o-ring at the bottom to seal it This tubing is 316 stainless steel, and as you'll notice, the bolt goes through here, which is the positive. This is where the positive modulation terminal connects. The inside has the bolt head contacting the surface. This whole thing has a positive charge when connected, so you definitely do not want to short out accidentally on this. Stainless steel washers with stainless steel spacers in there. This is a quarter to twenty rod, about twelve inches long. Goes all the way through it. And this is where the negative modulation terminal connects. And at the bottom you also see a drain plug. And there's also a groove cut in here with the O-ring to seal it. That's all there is to it. Ha 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 